Is the sun conscious? A question that may seem absurd to some, yet a philosophical conundrum to others. This question, in fact, is a doorway into the philosophical concept known as panpsychism, a theory that consciousness is a universal feature of all things. It posits that all parts of matter involve some form of consciousness, and that atoms and molecules, as well as humans and animals, possess subjective experience. Panpsychism is not a new concept, but one that has existed since the time of the ancient Greeks. It was Plato who first asserted that the entire cosmos is permeated with psyche, or soul. This perspective was prevalent in many ancient cultures, where celestial bodies, including the sun, were considered alive and intelligent. They were often referred to as visible gods, possessing souls and consciousness. Fast forward to the 21st century, and renowned biologist and author Rupert Sheldrake stirred the pot in 2021 with a paper suggesting the sun might indeed be conscious. This is a radical departure from the mechanistic materialism or physicalism that dominates modern science, which sees the universe as a non-conscious mechanical system. But what if this mechanistic view isn't the end all? What if consciousness isn't just an epiphenomenon produced by physical activity in brains or an illusion created by neurons firing? What if consciousness is a fundamental aspect of the universe present even in the seemingly inanimate objects like the sun? This is where panpsychism comes in, offering an alternative perspective that might seem poetic, but is not without its own rationale. It suggests that consciousness isn't just limited to brains, but is an intrinsic property of all things. This would mean that the sun, just like us, possesses a form of consciousness. A radical idea indeed, but one that challenges us to rethink our understanding of consciousness and its place in the universe. To summarize, we've delved into the thought-provoking question, is the sun conscious? We've explored the philosophical concept of panpsychism and its assertion that consciousness is a universal aspect of all matter. We've looked at how this idea contrasts with the current scientific paradigm of mechanistic materialism and how it offers an alternative perspective on consciousness. And finally, we've considered the possibility that the sun, like us, might be conscious. A notion that challenges our understanding of the universe and our place within it. In the end, whether or not the sun is conscious is a question that might not have a definitive answer. But it's a question worth pondering, a question that invites us to expand our understanding of consciousness and the universe we inhabit. After all, as the great philosopher Socrates once said, the unexamined life is not worth living.